Hi Aries, hello, here's your next three pairs for this week. So, we have... So what's going on here? Alright, when we look at the house of work, the sixth house here, um, I feel that there is something here that um, you've been waiting for. Something that you've been focused on for quite a while, Aries. Um, it's taken you to actually look at things in a different perspective in order to be focused. It's required you to have to wait and take your time and that's quite hard for you Aries because you know you are um, somebody that does things quite quickly a clean cut and clear way where you don't drag things out so this must have been a little bit difficult. But within the house of work, and I feel our daily matters, because it's the house of Virgo and, and things you feel in control of, I feel that your focus is going to pay off. I've got Queen of Swords here, which shows you're determined, you've really thought about this, like your analytical mind towards this, and this is definitely worth waiting for. Uh, patience will pay off. Yes, I do feel that this is a marvellous opportunity, and yes, I feel it's a post of elevation for you. So there is a success there that's worth waiting for. Please do bear that in mind. By the way, there is a sense and feeling that September is going to, end of September, is going to be a very, very important time, okay? Um, in matters of work this year. And I feel that that's actually, that important time does pay off. Um, dividends will come your way. Um, interesting. Underneath the house of work, uh, the seventh house, which is the house of relationships. Um, we've also got the opportunity here to uh, mix and blend with people at work. And you know what? There's some great relationships going on. And look, here we have, you know, the opportunity for a new position at work. Um, quite nice. You know, this is our second ace in this thread. The one up here was the Tower's Advice, giving you that inspiration. Uh, to create things and make things happen that you care about and care about yourself and to enjoy that. This is work opportunities here and I feel that this is a lovely balance. I feel it's a healthy balance. I also feel that it's a time of being able to actually go for the things that make you happy. I feel it's in moderation. I feel it's growth and I feel it's a great gift to you. Um, but I also feel that the relationship with work is going to be really healthy and there's a possibility of somebody new, new friends being made at work. So if you're looking for romance, you are being told to socialise with people from work. It may not be directly connected with the people that you socialise with, but for example, if you are in the opportunity to mix and blend with people that you work with, the places you go with those people to meet new people, that's where romance will come. So if you're looking for a relationship, Aries, look at your work, make sure you're socialising around work with people from work and people connected with the people that you work with. Okay? Um, and socialise. And then we come on to... so. Uh, what do we need to know, Aries? Here's yourself, you know. Uh, the Emperor is the card of Aries and I've got the King of Swords. So it's saying you know yourself very well. But I also feel that you are focused upon an enterprise, that you are being smart, that you are thinking about what you want to do even more carefully. And I feel that this has moved. Um, this idea that was coming up here could be coming up as in into further development of becoming a more serious matter because we've got the King of Swords, which I really like. Um, and I also feel that what the cards are telling you is, you know, this is something that's going to really please you. This is it. And I feel that you've put the effort into making sure that this is happening. Um, Aries, I feel that you need to be very clear. I feel that you need to pay attention. And I feel that you need to actually look at the fact that, you know, this side of your life is going into further education, knowledge, development, and is taking you on to another journey of life. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.